lawless. Now this is a spin-off of the equally popular Hercules series. Of course, any tale of ancient Greece requires swords as props. And remember, those that live by the sword make bloopers. <laughs> now, all Xena, played by Lucy Lawless, has to do is hang her sword on the hook. <laughs> okay, Xena's in position. She uh, sizes up the situation. This calls for her trusty sword. Uh-oh. <laughs> This time, someone else will draw Xena's sword. Ooh, ouch! Oh. <laughs> Here's a line of dialogue from Xena that just doesn't quite work. Watch. They'll kill you. I still have a few tricks up my sleeve. I don't have any sleeve. Um, <laughs> now here's Lucy who's really up for anything But this time they're stuck in the cave with a bunch of trained rats <laughs> That woman's a good sport <laughs> Who would do this to poor Lucy with a bunch of rats? <laughs> hey, before we leave Zena Let's take one more look at Lucy Lawless. Now, actually, she is a very accomplished horsewoman, but let's take a look at a couple of uh, less than accomplished moments. Now, for an experienced rider like Lucy, this is an easy dismount. Maybe they thought you were a threat. You're waiting for the right moment to say I told you so. <laughs> Here comes Zena galloping to the rescue. Right, right. <laughs> now, there's a new show on NBC this season called Profiler. It stars Allie Walker as a woman with a very, very unique ability. Let me tell you what it is. She can go to the crime scene and completely... What makes it so popular? Well, that's probably because we don't take ourselves too seriously. The script is very hip, the actors have fun, and it comes across to the viewers. Now, the bloopers you brought with you uh, sort of prove that point. Now. I understand. You do your own stunts? Well, I try my best. You know, I trained with martial arts master Douglas Wong. He showed me how to roll and fall and fight with swords and staffs. And he has taught you to handle all of this with style and skill. <clears throat> uh, Dick, he's a martial arts master, not a miracle worker. <laughs> <laughs> Now, this next blooper involves one of your co-stars. I believe it's uh, Michael Hurst. Yes, Michael plays Eolas. He's my partner in battle and in bloopers. <laughs> it's simple. Oh, no, there goes the set. Now, Kevin, here's where you show Hercules is not superhuman. First of all, you're bleeding. And next, you have to flip Eolus over your shoulder. He's so... Oops. <laughs> hey, Kevin, tell me about the blooper where the actor uh, uh, sort of follows you out of the scene. Oh, yeah, that, uh, that's Robert Trevor. He plays Salmonius. And he's got an arm lock around me, and I'm, I'm sort of leading him out of the scene where I'm only supposed to take two or three steps. Another actor's supposed to come in and stop me, but he, he never does. Stop it before you hurt yourself. Is he ever going to come in? I'm sorry. Yeah, with all of those actors on the set, it, it must get confusing sometimes. Well, that's true, Dick. I mean, it's, but it's all choreographed like a finely tuned ballet. You see, like in the scene, I'm supposed to say my lines while fighting my enemies. So the actors have to wait for their cues, and sometimes they don't. I said, no more fighting. You see the rhythm? I, I, I talk and then I fight. It's, it's very complicated. What's wrong with you people? We're ahead of my line. We're ahead of my line. 
<laughs> yeah, I've never seen so many extras in a television show. I mean, it looks like a cast of thousands. We have a lot of people around, Dick, and sometimes we use everybody. <laughs> Here come all the stage hands. <laughs> Kevin, your acting background is uh, quite extensive. I mean, you've appeared on Sybil, you've done several pilots, lots of commercials. That's right, and with all that experience, I've learned one thing. You never, ever stop until a director says cut. I think we can do better than that. Probably. Ah. I'm not going to stop. <laughs> you are a true professional. Well, you know, I, I try to be, and, you know, Dick, somebody has to do these things. Yeah, I know. It really makes me cry for you. Thank you very, very much for being with us and sharing your bloopers with us, Kevin. It's my pleasure. Thank you. Kevin Sorbo, ladies and gentlemen.